Hey, oh, Swabbies, it's you, Cappy. So, here we are, prepared to go through the magic cave after Magus. Um, we just had a basically entirely story-driven episode. So that was actually kind of cool for me. I was kind of excited about that. Um, most of these have been fight, 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 fight some more. Let's do some more fighting. And then, oh, hey, we're going to talk about something for a minute or two. And I kind of struggle with that because of how much I love this game and how... Oh, dang it. Um, and, and how much the story's involved. I feel like we're missing some of that part of the time. So... It was kind of cool to have that episode all about Frog and his backstory and Cyrus and, and why he hates Magus so much. Anyway, now I'm excited to press forward. Ooh, dual tech blade toss. Triple tech, triple raid! Um, be that magic you use. I have heard only magicians wield it now. Travel to the end of time and you may gain the use of magic. Oh, shoot. I think... No! No, what am I doing? I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Um, I think we can actually... What the heck, Edgar? There we go. I think we can actually go to the end of time from here, can't we? Or can we not? No. We can't. Urgh! Okay. Alright, we'll keep playing. Maybe we can find a different place where it'll let us go to the end of time. Because I would like... Oh, look, there's a chest I can't open. I would like to get Frog all hopped up on the magic juice. That would be pretty beneficial to my cause. Right now, it looks like I'm going to have to go all Robo all the way, because he's got the uh, laser spin. Yeah, it's going to murder all these guys at once. Um... Anyway, so a lot of that backstory from the last level is a lot of why I like Frog so much, why I think he's so stinking cool. Um, just that background, you know, he's a super good swordsman or whatever, but he was bullied as a kid and he never knew if he could be a knight or not. And, uh, anyway, I just think he's really cool. Gremlins! I want to get him to the end of time, though, so I can use my freaking magic spells. We'll use a Tri-Tech here in a little while. Probably should have dropped it there, just so everybody can see how cool it was, but we'll wait a little bit. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's just drop it right now. Just for funsies. Just for fun. We're stretchy pants. Just for fun. Oh, jeez, I didn't realize it's only on one person. <laughs> I, I only did a thousand damage. No, no bigs. No big deal. Anyway, so... Like I said, I'm just excited that we've had an opportunity to, to get some background. Um, that's one of those things, now that we've kind of hit this point in the game, we're going to get a little bit more of that. It's less, you know, like, we don't know what we're doing, and a lot more, you know, hunt the bad guy, figure out what's going on, kind of stuff. Oh no! No written in blood. The juggler in Magus's castle strengthens his guard when attacked. Beware. Okay. Mm. Dang it. I really, really want to go to the end of time. I just don't think it's going to let me. Which is unfortunate. So, spooky castle you got here, bro. Spooktacular. This can only be. Magus's castle.
So, Magus's theme is probably my favorite make ever. Like, I really, really like Frog's theme, but Magus's evil theme of evilness is my favorite. Hey, lady. Haha. Uh -huh. Silence. Ooh, mid either. Wanna play? Wanna play? Looks kinda like Masa and Moon. Haha. Uh -huh. This is a little creepy, guys. Oh, huh, huh, huh. Mid ether. Shelter. Okay. Perhaps this was not where I was supposed to go first? I don't know. Oh, this looks our treasure. Haha. -ha. Wanna play? Ooh, creepy little children. Laka, whatever are you doing here? R six six Y don't waste your strength. Uh Frog, you're safe. Oh look, it's my mom. So this is where you've been since the festival. You had me worried sick. Okay, seriously, guys, come on. There's a little bat following me. I believe that's probably significant. No, oh, I want you little monsters to get out of the way. Or for... Oh, there we go. Ozzy! Ozzy! Welcome, Glenn. Or should I say, Sir Froggy? <laughs> say, looks like you got some replacements for Cyrus. Magus is a tad busy right now. You'll have to take up your business with me. The Swordsman Slash and Flea, the Magician, and... You'll have to defeat all 100 of the beasts in Magus's castle. Okay, let's let's just see what my damage is going to do here before I start. There we go. I think it's going to be worth just clubbing guys, at least if they're henches and vamps. I really, if I was smart, I would have taken the time to get that stupid sight scope from Lucka. I keep forgetting to steal it from her. Boom! With, uh, with Chrono's, uh, counterattack. This will be a lot easier, too. Crimson Rain, HP down. Jerk. Okay, so was that not really a safe point? Okay. Alright, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and drop a shelter and save. This is gonna be kind of a short episode today. Um, because I don't want to, uh... I don't want to be, like, right in the middle of something and end up having, like, another 20, 30, 40 minute stinking episode again. Um... So we're going to go ahead and end it right here, because that's when the story wants us to end it. And we listen to the story, forsooth! Um, Alright, guys. So, thanks for joining us through the Magic Cave and into the beginning of uh, Magus's lair. Uh, up next, we're going to have to fight Flea, and Slash, and Ozzy. Make our way to the evil Magus. Alright, guys. No, no rest for the wicked.